Naga Munchetti was defended by Carol Vorderman after she found herself on the receiving end of a troll on X, formerly known as Twitter, after she hosted Have I Got News For You. BBC Breakfast's Naga Munchetti has slapped back at a troll who branded her a total C asterisk 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 in a vile post on X, formerly known as Twitter. The user took umbrage at one of her jokes about Boris Johnson when she hosted Have I Got News For You on Friday night. In the clip that irked them, Naga was talking about Boris Johnson's evidence at the COVID inquiry and referenced his remark. Abusive messages are part of the creative process. Responding to a post of the clip, where the presenter also described the former prime minister as a T asterisk 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 asterisk. The troll wrote, It is well known inside and outside of the media circuit that at TV Naga 01 is a total C asterisk T. Rather than find the accusation offensive, the star clapped back. I must ask my, obviously very few, friends to stop talking to strangers. Her humorous response drew support from Carol Vorderman who commented, Ah, the old misogynists are out in force. Again. Gets dull after a while doesn't it? Sending best. Carol wasn't the only person defending her and Naga's huge fanbase flooded the comments in support of her. A user calling themselves at Shearer's buddy said, there has been nothing in the gossip columns about this at all. So to say it's doubtful is an understatement. I think Naga's great, attractive, intelligent and very funny. Jealous? Or just a little racist? Inquired at Sarah underscore Jane 67. At UK Film TV critic chimed in. That's your opinion but a few years ago she was on the radio and spoke about golf with such expertise I was transfixed. Sadly I had lost four of my family over a period of five months. Naga's enthusiasm helped me get on with life. Meanwhile, at Jules BFC 69 opined. I'm sure your 81 followers disagree with you as she's lovely. The trolling comes just days after a 2020 interview resurfaced in which she admitted that not everyone likes her. She shared the brutal advice her director husband, James Hager, told her when she first started out in news. You need to have thicker skin. People either love you or hate you, but you need to not take it personally, he told her. In the interview with The Guardian, She said Jameis' advice provided her with a huge lesson and further admitted that she has taken it into her off-screen life, too. She said, It's not that I don't care, but it's in perspective. I always assume that people don't like me. It's a really weird thing. I think I grow on people. I don't think I make a great first impression. I'm comfortable with that. I think people see a loud person who's opinionated and not afraid to say what she thinks.